Welcome to Data Points. I am Brian Hamilton, and today I will be discussing the just announced weekly jobless claims data. Before the opening bell, the Labor Department reported that jobless claims rose by 17,000 to 233,000, but it was below the expected reading of 240,000. This data shows that the U.S. labor market remains very strong. The chart here shows the last two years of jobless claims. As you can see, jobless claims have been steadily dropping since January of 2016, with the exception of a few spikes in the fall of 2017 and one in the beginning of 2018. But overall, claims have remained under 300,000. The recent uptick in the, in the first week of January was attributed to seasonal jobs over the holiday. But the subsequent two weeks have been well below the 240,000 level indicating that layoffs are becoming more rare and hiring remains very strong. The overall unemployment rate is expected to remain at 4.1 percent. Tomorrow we'll be getting two really important economic data points before the opening bell, the fourth quarter GDP and the durable goods orders reports. They are important future indicators of both the overall health of the economy and the manufacturing sector. The GDP report is expected to come in at 2.9 percent with consumer spending being the biggest driver for the quarter. Durable goods orders, which reflect the new orders placed with manufacturers for immediate and future delivery of factory goods, is expected to show a 0.6% improvement. This will be a solid indicator that the manufacturing sector continues to remain strong. Thanks for watching. Be sure to check out more Data Points videos as we highlight all the important economic news that impacts the markets.